What's up everybody? This is Sebastian. I was able to find a cool, solid case for my Coral HTPU dev board made entirely from aluminum. The top cover is a thick, darkened acrylic and all ports are available. There are even wall mounts at the back of the case and an opening for ambient cooling. The price tag is 50 US, available on Amazon. Since it is virtually impossible to get my hands on the Coral Camera module, I'll be showing you today how to make a good use of what you already have. Any cheap or expensive USB camera will do and will let you run examples from the Google Coral website, such as the person segmentation video example. Well, let's start by hooking up the camera to the Coral Dev board uh, the right way, if I can figure out how to do it. I'm going to use the older version of Ubuntu 20 LTS, since this version works seamlessly with Coral. First, power up the Dev board and either link it with your machine over Wi-Fi or over the OTG cable. Then issue the MDT shell command to establish a link. It also seems that the Coral Dev board has not experienced any serious updates to the Mendel OS for the last two years. The V4L utils packages let us discover any media devices connected to the Coral including our USB camera. Since it is already installed on my system, nothing has changed on my Coral. Then, listing the media devices reveals the unconnected and inactive native Coral camera as video zero, but also the newly connected USB camera as video one. Now I am to CD to the directory where the person segmentation example lives. I pulled the code from GitHub according to the examples listed on the Coral AI website. In a few moments we will run the Python bodypix script delivered by Google on the Coral Dev board utilizing the USB camera. In case you are interested in the code behind this script, here it is. As the source, let me choose the USB camera and keep my fingers crossed. Great, it works! That wasn't hard, was it? As always, thanks for watching. See you later!